Hey guys, welcome to this new series on my channel. If it's successful, I'll continue with it. But if it's not, let's just all forget this ever happened. Recently, if you didn't already know, I got a Tesla Model 3. Love you, babe. And in my Twitter bio, I say that I weirdly flex a lot. So, due to the Model 3 becoming cheaper and more people being able to afford one, I'm gonna show you all some weird ways on how you can show it off. Or say that you have one. Let's get started! And remember, this is all just satire. First off, this is the Model 3 key. It's very similar to a credit card, and it could be confused for one. So, if you want to flex to your cashier, accidentally give them this instead of your credit card. And your total is... $1.24. How will you be paying? Credit, please. Thank you. Ah, uh, this doesn't seem to be a working credit card. Oh, sorry! This is the key to my Tesla. You know, you spend that much money on a nice car, and you expect the key to be more than a cheap card. Heh, <laughs> you know the feeling, right? Uh-huh. That is just so unacceptable. Anyway, here's my credit card. Thanks. This card also isn't working. Oops! Silly me! That's a key card from my VIP hotel suite. Since it's declined, want me to shred it for you? You're welcome. Another key you can use with your Tesla is your iPhone and the Tesla app. You can also use Siri to open apps. So preferably in a very public place, turn off your iPhone and try to open your Tesla app with Siri. Hey Siri, open the Tesla app. I said, hey Siri, open the Tesla app. God! Doesn't Siri suck so much? I didn't pay that much money for an iPhone and a Tesla for them not to work together. Am I right, guys? <laughs> hey Siri, open the Tesla app! Gosh, guys, it's still not working for some reason. To you, Siri, please turn on your iPhone, dumbass. Since your Tesla is an all-electric car, no gas means no fumes. Every time your friend offers to drive you in their gas car, you should suddenly develop an asthma attack. Hey man, you ready to go? Yep, I'm ready. <laughs> Is there something wrong? Oh, nothing. <coughs> I think I just got too used to my new Tesla. Now what does that have to do with this? <coughs> it's just that since I got used to an all-electric car with no fumes, <coughs> which <coughs> was <coughs> expensive, I think I'm having an allergic reaction to your gas car fumes. <coughs> but I've seen you vape. <coughs> do you want to just take your car? <coughs> nah, it's fine. <coughs> What's under the hood of a Tesla? Since it's an electric car, there's no engine. Just a storage space named the front trunk, or frunk. It's perfect for showing off to more cashiers. All right, have a great day. Say the line. And I hope you saved money and lived better. Actually, could you help me carry all of my groceries to my car, please? But you don't look old or that disabled. Just do it, goddammit! Ugh. Fine. Thanks. Ugh. Why did you have to park all the way in the back? Because I don't want these broke people to load the resale value of my car just by looking at it. Okay. Here we are. Great. I'll just put these in the trunk then. Actually, could you put them in here, please? All right. Well, are you gonna ask the question? What question? How come there's no engine? Well, 
this thing is called the frunk and well thanks for the help I'm sure you have to get back to your job now One feature of the Tesla app is that you can turn on air conditioning from your phone. Which means if you leave your baby or your dog in the car on a hot day, you can turn it on from afar so they can stay cool. Yes, there is dog mode, which turns on the AC right after you leave, but we're trying to flex here! Disable it, then leave. <laughs> oh my god! That dog is gonna die in that car! Where's the owner? No worries, it's a Tesla, so I have the ability to access climate from anywhere with this app. Okay, so like, turn it on now! The app can also unlock the car, open the frunk or trunk, flash the lights, honk the horn, show its location, and there's this thing called summon. Like, come on already! The temperature right now is super hot! Oh, all right. See? Everything's fine. Ooh. Hey, Jessica, I like totally saved a life today. Yes! Before I was interrupted, another feature in the app is Summon. You can move your Tesla with your phone, so it can replace your dog, if you need a new one. Who's a good boy? <laughs> yes you are! Yes you... are! Heh! A French Bulldog? How broke! Gas stations are useless to you now, but why not go to one and make a viral video? You may look a bit silly, but now millions of people know that you have a Tesla. Oh, so this is where you put the gas in. <laughs> All Teslas now have built-in games. So technically, this car is a game console. Try trading it into GameStop. The best flex is to make them a low offer first. You can have my car console for $72 store credit or $60 cash. Sorry, but we've gone bankrupt and this location is out of business. How did you even get in here? If you have a kid that cannot drive yet, buy them a Tesla for kids. So they can start flexing early, then flex bigger when they grow up. For now, they can flex with you in your shadow. Ugh, not again. Yeah! Hey, neighbor! That's my son! Maybe he'll be as successful as me one day. Or at least as successful as him. Wow, I would love for my only personality trait is to be known as the guy who has the Tesla. You know what? Get out of the way, son! I'm launching out of here! Let me tell you something, buddy. You're a joke that's gonna stay broke. Wow, what a great rhyme. Get off my property before I call the police. Fine, I'll catch your broke ass later. Bye! Watch it, watch it! Whoa, what was that? <sighs> a bad neighborhood is a good neighborhood for showing off to the broke. Man, what a lovely neighborhood that I have enough trust in to keep my car running and my door open! Get out of the car! Now! Oh no! Please don't 
steal it. What the hell kind of car is this? Ha! Why don't you use the built-in web browser to find out that you can't easily take this high-tech car? Then I'll just take a piss in here then! No wait! Don't do that! Back to the summon feature. You get the most attention from people if you have an injury, so it's the perfect time to show off more of that feature. Ah! Uh, uh. <laughs> Oh my god! Are you alright? Yeah, uh, I just accidentally ran myself over with my own car. How the hell do you do that? With the Tesla summon feature, you can move the car backwards or forwards with your phone. Whoa, can I see that? So if I hold this button, the car will move by itself? Uh, cool! Oh, I almost forgot. You gotta flex on your mother! Who told you that you would get nowhere by dropping out of college to do YouTube videos?! <laughs> Ahem. That's a common thing all moms are known for. The more emotional the flex is, the better. I'll show you, mom! Myself. Hey, you! This is what you do when you don't have to go to college! Don't you know that Teslas don't give off any exhaust fumes because they're all electric? You stupid Asian mother who doesn't know anything about technology! Time for late abortion! Oh. Wait, no! Jokes on you! Even though these seats are white, stains will come off easily. Superchargers are a place where you can charge your Tesla super fast, for super cheap, or free sometimes. The only bad thing about them is that they're placed near or in normal parking lots, where broke people and their gas cars are. Gross! Use this to your advantage to show off even more! Wait! What's that smell? Disgusting! Ha! Bet you wish you could get free gas like me! <laughs> ah! But be careful, there's always a bigger fish out there. Ha! A Model 3? That's... We got a Model 3. Yeah, me too. I wasn't talking to you guys. Bro boy! And for the final way for you to flex your Tesla, just make a YouTube video flexing about how you own a Tesla and call it satire so no one in your 13 year old audience will get angry. And so with that, thank you guys for watching, comment, like, and subscribe, and I'll see you guys later. Bye! For those of you asking, how can you afford this? Well, three things. These videos, these vlogs, and add in a little sprinkle of. Apparently, about a year ago, I said that I would name my Tesla, Tesla Brooks.
I also said that I would smash my Subaru in front of some homeless people. So... Hope no one calls the police.